Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Warwick and you're watching Gas Tax Garage, the channel that's here to help you figure out how to build your dream garage. Well, I tinker around with projects such as my TW200, my Jeep Gladiator, and plenty more things. But today is a sad day. I haven't been using a couple of my things that I purchased because of the time we're in. And I finally decided to let one of them go. So, let's jump right into it. So, I really didn't plan on selling this. Um, it's just I haven't used it in such a long time. You know, COVID kind of screwed everything up. And all these events got cancelled. And now, I just don't watch the media. Because I don't know who to believe. And that's why my channel went from building the R32 to going and building some four-roading, <laughs> four-by-fouring cars off the grid camper because I'm really not going to be seeing people for a while. I mean, don't get me wrong. I think there's a lot of bad information out there. But since I can't trust anyone's knowledge, I'm just going to make the best guess for my family and make the best out of it. And that's why I got this baby. Show my kids America. I mean, don't get me wrong, I bought this because I wanted to use it, but I don't see myself using it in the next year or two. So what's the point of just having it sit and waste away? So I think it's just time to sell it. I mean, don't get me wrong, I looked forever to find what I wanted, and when I found it, I jumped on it. But, you know, times change everything. The guy that reached out is gonna do everything that I was gonna do, and he's gonna start this Saturday, so. I just don't want my stuff sitting around if I can't use it because the world is in a weird ass place right now. That was caught on camera, but I used two jumper packs to jump. And this just like melted apart. I thought I was gonna have a fire here in a second. Well, this was on fire. Anyways, let's move it. Give my shitty clutch control here. Brakes were seized up. <laughs> Snow here. And I'm sitting on a milk crate. Because, <laughs> you know, the seats are removed. I don't know if I mentioned it, but the guy that's coming tomorrow actually found me on YouTube. So if you uh, watched my uh, video a couple days ago about how much money I make on YouTube, I guess this will help out with that. Give me some of my money back. Well, there it is in all its glory. R32. 
But you guys didn't think I was selling this. Oh no, I was keeping this. <laughs> I just had to move all of this because I'm selling my race trailer. So, as I mentioned, I'm not gonna go to events. I'm not gonna see you guys. Unfortunately, I'm not gonna go to Wookiees in the Woods. I wanna meet everyone. I don't know what's happening with this virus. I don't believe anyone that talks about this virus. All I know is I'd rather be safe and healthy, uh, doing my own thing without the risk. So, uh, <laughs> I'm going to be selling the race trailer. I don't think I'm going to be using it for two years. I'll get another one then. Uh, and I wasn't actually selling it. Someone reached out and said they wanted it. So that's why it worked. But for you guys wondering, R32 is here. It's still in a million pieces, but it's not going anywhere. I know there's been a lot of questions about where it's been. Uh, it's been down there <laughs> behind all my other crap. So when I'm done with all my other builds, yes, I will be working on the R32. I've got, I keep buying parts. I spend, I don't know, maybe $400 a month on parts on this because every time I see something cool, I want to do something unique with this. Uh, I, I buy the parts. So anyways, stick around. It may be six months, two months. Who knows when I'll be working on this. But right now I'm doing a video a day for the last three days. So if I keep doing that, uh, maybe I'll be working on this by next week. Anyways, guys, thanks a lot for stopping by. Um, yep, R32 is still here. But until next time, be sure you like, subscribe, and I'll see you then.